Our Commander 2RPM activated switch. Follow the instructions to complete the installation. After wiring is completed, make sure the machine has power. The following is its design logic. Then he has the output of R1 and R2. There are also cylinder settings, and we will operate it. Push the button. R1 is the RPM activated switch. Press button again. R2 is the RPM activated switch. Press again. This is the choice of cylinder. Then let's start with R1. Turn the knob to adjust the value. Set at 2000. Then click the enter button. He will have a trigger frequency. Continuous. Slowly flashes. Mid flashes. Fastest flashes. Then I will choose OUT1 constant output mode. Then press enter again to confirm. At this time, the screen will come back to display. Then you can press the setting button again. Then select R2 output. Choose 3000 revolutions per minute this time. Same as just now. After setting the RPM, you also need to select the output frequency. For R2, I chose the fastest flash in the fourth segment as a shift reminder light. At this point, the screen will resume display again. Finally, set the cylinder. I connected the RPM signal to the ignition system. The ignition of this cars. I want to set up two cylinders. It will display the correct RPM. After selecting, press OK. This completes the settings.